Hello to all. Welcome to the Content Promoter, our YouTube channel. Your host is me, Ava. Today, we'll discuss Jeff Bezos' 400 million mega yacht. But first, subscribe right away so you won't miss a single one of our fascinating and luxurious videos. Let's get started. The Flying Fox Super Yacht is so opulent that it contrasts sharply with the Titanic. When this $400 million boat was discovered off the coast of Turkey in 2019, it sent the boating community into a frenzy. Many people assume that the opulent superyacht belonged to Amazon's founder Jeff Bezos because of its extreme size and scale. The Flying Fox is a floating metropolis with a vast selection of opulent amenities. The superyacht has two helipads that can be turned into dance floors, a cinema, and a 40-foot pool. Few people have the means to sail the high seas in the mega yacht as lavish as the Flying Fox. There is no way you could afford this pricey behemoth unless you have billions lying around. The Flying Fox, a super yacht built by Lursen in 2019, is thought to be worth around $400 million, and its annual maintenance costs are estimated to be at least $15 million. The cost of crew salaries, repairs, and docking fees is rising alarmingly quickly every year. Soon, only the top 1% of the top 1% will be able to afford one of these amazing super yachts. Even renting the Flying Fox costs an arm and a leg. It costs $4 million to charter the vessel for just one week. Talk about an expensive vacation. So, how big is the Flying Fox exactly? It is the 18th largest super yacht in the world, measuring 466 feet long and 74 feet wide. With its 14th largest interior of any yacht, it has plenty of room for 55 crew members and 22 guests. Even when compared to other incredibly expensive super yachts, the Flying Fox really stands out. The exterior of the yacht was created by renowned naval architect E.P. Oino, and the yacht has a very futuristic appearance with its sleek curved exterior. A yacht of this caliber undoubtedly requires an elite crew. The Flying Fox's crew is made up entirely of former British military personnel, which explains why they are paid so well. Crew members earn a lot of money. The annual salary of a captain of a yacht this size can reach $450,000, while that of the chief engineer is probably around $150,000. The Flying Fox is not a weakling. You'd be mistaken if you believed that a yacht of this size would move slowly. Despite being enormous, the pricey cruiser has a top speed of 20 knots. 15 knots is a comfortable cruise speed. Additionally, the Flying Fox has a fleet of personal watercraft that includes nine tenders, four jet skis, and even a small submarine. Billionaire visitors can charter a tender to travel to a secluded island and arrange a private alfresco beach dinner. Consider consuming bluefin tuna sashimi prepared by the yacht's elite culinary staff. Use one of the kayaks from the yacht to explore the coastline. Use a hoverboard provided by the dive center, or give kite surfing a go if you're looking for some extreme excitement. Even a fleet of Vespa GTS Super 300s is available for guests to use on the Flying Fox to explore nearby islands in style. While the Flying Fox is anchored in the Monaco Harbor, Vespas are ideal for navigating the city's cobblestone streets. A super yacht like the Flying Fox can be rented out for a trip to some of the world's most stunning and remote marine locations. A team of expert divers working on the yacht can take wealthy guests to some of the most beautiful underwater locations in the planet, including coral reefs, breathtaking underwater cliffs, and extraordinary marine life. The Flying Fox is luxurious throughout. Each square inch of the six-deck mega yacht is extremely opulent. The Flying Fox has two helipads, whereas nearly every super yacht in the world has one. The ability to transform two helipads into dance floors is even more amazing. Just picture the scene at a dance party for billionaires. 
a staggering 40-foot-long pool that can be divided in half by a retractable wall, serves as a flying fox's unique and powerful pull. The visitors use one side to swim laps and the other to play a game of water volleyball. The pool's water can change from being warm to bitterly cold in just 10 seconds and it empties in just 3 minutes. It has two warm and cold tanks, so you can customize the temperature to your preference. The 4,305 square foot spa in the Flying Fox is extremely modern. It has two stories, and visitors can take advantage of a variety of soothing services like electrical facials and body contouring. All of your stress will be relieved by a massage in a rain shower. Even the wealthiest individuals in the world must manage stress. Every room on the Flying Fox is as opulent as one in a five-star hotel. With a private balcony in each cabin, visitors can take in breathtaking views of places like Greece and the French Riviera. The enormous outdoor dining area is the ideal location to savor a fine meal. The billionaires are eating beluga caviar, wagyu steak, and iberico ham while we're stuck here eating instant food. The most stunning room in the yacht might just be the 328 square foot master suite on the top deck. It even has its jacuzzi and gas fire pit. Every VIP suite on the yacht has an ensuite bathroom, and there is 11 state rooms in total. The Flying Fox's sauna for cryotherapy is among its distinctive features. One of these cutting-edge saunas is featured for the first time ever in a journal. The main chamber of the cryotherapy sauna is set to minus 116 degrees Fahrenheit, while the anti-chamber is set to minus 40 degrees. Elite athletes should use it because it promotes muscle regeneration. The Flying Fox's top-notch gym's cryo sauna is the best place to unwind after a strenuous workout. All former Olympic athletes can use the 970-square-foot gym's modern exercise equipment and trainers. If you want to see a movie, go to Flying Fox's movie theater, which has cutting-edge AV equipment, and watch a movie. You can catch up on the latest shows on Netflix or Amazon Prime Video, even if you're in the middle of the ocean. In case you want to watch a movie under the stars, there's even an outdoor movie screen on the deck. The cinema room is furnished with D-Box seats and a cutting-edge surround sound system. If you're in the mood for a cocktail, head on over to the two-story Mark Behrman-designed bar area. It features a wood fireplace and a huge dining table with space for every guest. Who is the owner of this magnificent yacht? Many users on Twitter assumed it belonged to Jeff Bezos, whose net worth is estimated to be $118 billion when it was first discovered in the coast of Turkey. With ease, Jeff Bezos could afford this incredible super yacht. Amazon representatives quickly refuted the claim that Jeff Bezos does enjoy time on the open seas, saying instead that he prefers to unwind on the $590 million rising sun, which is owned by his close friend and business tycoon, David Geffen. Jeff Bezos was seen on the rising sun in 2019 with Lauren Sanchez, his girlfriend. Off the coast of Spain, the couple was having a party on the yacht. The rising sun is a status symbol for celebrities and billionaires alike. Barack and Michelle Obama, Oscar-winning director J.J. Abrams, Netflix co-CEO Ted Sarandos, and Disney executive chairman Bob Iger have all attended parties he has hosted on the yacht. Tom Hanks, Chris Rock, Jeffrey Seinfeld, Julia Roberts, and Leonardo DiCaprio have all been spotted on the yacht. Could we possibly use more names now? The Rising Sun, which was also constructed by Lurson, has a staff of 55 people and can house 18 guests. It has a wine cellar, a basketball court gym, and a double high theater. It might even surpass the Flying Fox in terms of impressiveness. The Flying Fox's true owner is still unknown, but we do know that Imperial Yachts offers yacht charters. 
The Flying Fox is just one of the many super yachts that the Monaco-based yacht broker has available for charter. Even if it's just for a short while, if you have $4 million lying around, you too could live like Jeff Bezos. The impressive super yacht, the Flying Fox, might not be Jeff Bezos's, but he could certainly rent it. For Bezos, the $4 million charter fee is a drop in the ocean. It would take him only 18 minutes to earn enough money to pay for the mega yacht's weekly rental at his current rate of $224,844 per minute. That's all everyone! Thanks for watching till the end! Please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel so you will never miss any of our interesting and luxurious places. Again, I'm Ava, and I'll see you soon on our next video.